Dr. Hilary Faust comes from a family of physicians and is well aware that sleep is a premium but important as she completes her medical training. When I do rotations now where I'm doing 30-hour shifts, getting an hour of sleep or even half an hour of sleep is, makes a, a huge difference and I do feel much better after that. However, sleep is not a guarantee on these shifts. There's a large amount of research showing that sleep deprivation can adversely affect performance and safety. There have been concerns for a long time that having prolonged periods of wakefulness could really contribute to impaired performance among interns. Doctors Kevin Volpe from the Philadelphia VA Medical Center and David Dingus, both with the University of Pennsylvania Perlman School of Medicine and co-authors, conducted a randomized trial with a group of medical interns who worked at UPenn and the Philadelphia VA. Every other month, one group had protected sleep periods during their shift. They turned in phones and pagers to the residents on call. The other group worked a standard schedule and only slept if time allowed. The average amount that interns slept increased by about 50 percent in the months in which interns had a protected sleep period from about two hours a night to about three hours a night. The study appears in a theme issue on medical education in JAMA, Journal of the American Medical Association. They slept earlier, longer, and less disturbed. We didn't completely give them a full night's sleep, but even the three hours, the 50 percent more sleep they got uh, was beneficial. People had higher cognitive performance on the mornings following being having protected sleep periods. Intern participation was key. And researchers say more than 98 percent of the time, interns turned over their cell phones to the covering resident. Residents are no different than anyone else. They need sleep. And if you give them a safe, secure, protected opportunity to take it, where they don't have to feel guilty or be, be disturbed repeatedly, and they can actually sleep, they will. Dr. Faust says she's been up since about 8 a.m. yesterday morning. I actually feel great right now. I got an hour of sleep last night, so I feel pretty good. Catherine Dolph, The JAMA Report.